This is Kenny's Guitar Tech Tips with me, Kenny Barnwell, professional touring guitar tech. I've tech for some big name artists and toured around the world, which means I've met a ton of people, been in a variety of situations, and made my fair share of mistakes. And I've learned a thing or two about how to adapt to the inconsistencies of the live show. I want to share with you another option, method, or trick that you can try out and see if it works for you. Kenny Barnwell. Thanks for showing interest in guitar teching and what it means to be a guitar tech on tour with bands. Many of you may already know, but a touring guitar tech differs than a guitar repair technician. The main difference is, is that a guitar repair technician has the time, the tools, and the workspace in a shop environment to perform the repairs necessary to get the instrument back in playing condition. A guitar technician on tour, like myself, will typically have very little time and oftentimes have to think of innovative ways to get the instrument, the amp, the pedal boards to send signal and to play properly for that night's show. And oftentimes will not have the necessary tools to perform extensive repairs will, and will, will end up either taking it to their home shop or take it to their local uh, guitar repair guy that they trust. There are so many variables to the live show, as well as so many methods and, and tricks to achieve the same goals in guitar teching. And that's why I've always said that if you find something that works for you, then do it. If you've liked my videos uh, on my YouTube channel, Kenny's Guitar Tech Tips, then maybe you'll be interested in liking my Facebook page, Kenny's Guitar Tech Tips and Tricks, where I give a little bit more. I have a segment called Kenny's Picked for Interesting Instruments, um, which I showcase and feature interesting different instruments from around the world. I also have additional tips and tricks that you won't see on my videos, as well as a, a plethora of information um, that I've gathered up from the web and all on one source. So go to my Facebook page, Kenny's Guitar Tech Tips and Tricks, and like it. Follow me on Twitter, at Kenny Barnwell. I also have been writing articles uh, for roadie.net, which is an excellent resource or for those that are already uh, technicians or, or on the road or just have an interest in being a roadie and what it takes. Um, roadie.net is an excellent resource for that. You can find roadie jobs um, as well as information not just uh, from myself, guitar teching, but uh, audio, lighting, and video and pyrotechnic world as well. I also want to tell you about some of the new uh, segments that I'm going to include on my YouTube channel at the top of the year. I have a new segment that will start at the top of the year where I interview other backline guitar, drum, and keyboard techs uh, in the industry given their point of view. And another new segment that will, that will begin the, after the new year, it's a segment called You Can't Make That Stuff Up. It's stories from different techs uh, over the years that they've experience these stories that can only happen on the road that I'd love to share with you. My main reason for doing these articles, these videos, these blogs, um, and gathering up all these resources is, uh, unlike guitar repair, there's not, there are not any books written about being a touring guitar technician. And uh, so my main goal with this is to educate myself um, as well as educate anyone else who's interested in the professional touring world if there's any other subjects that I haven't covered or any anything specific that interests you that you might want me to write about or do a video about, I'm open to suggestions. I really appreciate your interest. Thanks for watching. I'm Kenny, and this has been the tip for the day.